Got gifts for kids this morning. Cecilia Pearson with Alabama Baby and Child Magazine is here today. You brought some cool stuff. Hey, Cece. Hey, did how you have a good doing? Thanksgiving? I did. Wonderful. All right, what'd you bring today? Well, first we're going to start off. We got something for the very little ones. These are uh, by Plain Toys, and this is a little ball. Uh, it's for uh, children that are like six months or or uh, younger. Yeah. Um, but basically, when they roll it on the floor. It claps, and so you know I can't roll it here, but if it rolls, Whoa. when it rolls, it claps, and that's you know kind of a lot of fun. But this is you know what we call from our green toy uh, collection because it's made with all wood. There's no parts that are harmful, and the ink is uh, vegetable dye. And oh, so again, when they put this in their mouth and things like that, it's going to be very safe. Okay. And so that's uh, and something. It's called what? It's called uh, just a um, clapping roller. Okay. Clapping well. roller. That name is very creative because it is a clapping roller. I know. Okay. And then here's another green toy. This is a <laughs> rocket. And this one is cool because it's made from recycled milk jugs. And it's going to have, again, the same earth friendly um, kind of elements for it. There's no, uh, you know, harmful plastics or things like that in it um, because it is a recycled material. My coworker, Claire Huddleston, seems to be very interested <laughs> really? in, in, the in what we're doing now. Um, <laughs> did you? Did you announce it? <laughs> Not yet. And oh, then, whoops. Okay. <laughs> and then we also have the uh, green tugboat. And this is very cool because it'll, you know, be in the uh, tub with them, but it also is great uh, as a spout to wash oh, their cute, hair with. Cute. And so that kind of makes uh, tub, tub uh, time fun. And all of that came from Swaddle and Homewood, and I think they have one a great selection of green toys. Okay. The next one that we really recommend is great for any, any kind of book and pajamas. Mm -hmm. You know, these uh, books and pajamas came from Jack and Jill and Homewood but they've got a great selection of Christmas pajamas and then this is Christopher Popkinkins and he is the Hi, very the world first is elf. He's the very first elf um, that came mm -hmm. about in 1985, so um, oh, how he cool can do is all that? the fun things. Alright, now we're getting in over to the things that we may have grown up with yeah. or when we were kids. Well, that's Simon. That is shocking that Mickey was over here. Mm. Go ahead. And Simon, Simon is celebrating his 35th anniversary. So I love toys that we grew up with yeah. that we get to share with our children. He's actually been upgraded a little bit. You see he has a more modern uh, look. And instead of having to push the button real hard, there you go. You just touch it. And we all had a Jack in the Box. Yes. Is this is still, kids still love it's, the Jack in the Box. And it's, it's, it's a must have for every kid's box. toy box. And these came from Homewood Toy and Hobby. And they always have these kind of vent. Oh! So cute. It's a must have. Star Wars, uh, Star Wars Lego. Can't another, go wrong with Legos. Yeah, another must have in a kid's toy box is, star, uh, is Lego. So just some cute ideas. Yeah, Melissa more. and Doug, that's a very popular line for uh, children's items and is very interactive. Kind of like Jack in the Box. It's very silent. good. All right, lots of great ideas. Yes. Cece, thank you very thank much. ALBabyMag.com if it. you want more details. <laughs> All right, now let's go to Jake.